we'll be talking about what for him, which was once called a rat killer. So if you've got someone in your family, some elderly, some, you know, family members who are taking warfarin, then this video might save their life in case they have the harmful effects or they succumb injuries. And I will also tell you what to do in case of any such injuries or emergencies. So stay us till the end. So from rat killer to lifesaver, that's why I've named it like this because in the initial days when warfarin came, as I said, it changed the medicine industry. And it, this would be a surprising story of blood, science, and saving lives. Okay. So when I say Warfarin was a rat killer, you would be thinking this guy is talking nonsense, isn't it? Because if I'm going to tell you that rat poison actually saved lives, you would be like, nah, that doesn't happen. But this is an absolute true story. In the 1920s, the rat poison was invented, but Warfarin was not brought into medical practice than then and there. In the 1950s is when we started using warfarin for various blood clot related problems. And at the moment, there are over 25 million people all over the globe who take warfarin for various medical conditions, be it atrial fibrillation, like, you know, when your heart has having a funny rhythm and it's irregular, it can cause clots and it can go in the brain. People who had heart surgeries, mechanical valve surgeries, People who also had DVT or pulmonary embolisms, few of them are still on the warfarin. Sure, it's very funny how it all came into play. 